<laughs> Yo, what is going on, man? We back with another video, man. This is the top 10 forms of Ichigo from Bleach, man. Hey, we got some beautiful ladies in here, man. We about to get lit, man. So spam that like button, man. Go ahead and introduce yourself. Let them know where they can find you at. Me, Didi. You can follow me on Instagram at Kalia.Delgado. You can also follow me well, subscribe to me on YouTube at Kalia Delgado as well. And follow me on TikTok if you want, Calgary DZ. Okay, what you got on today? What you got on? I want to see. It's just a patchwork, you know. Okay. That's fire. That was fire. That was fire. And then this cardigan from Urban. Hey guys, it's Cassie G. Make sure y'all subscribe to my YouTube channel at Cassie G. C-A-S-S-I space G. G. Yeah, don't forget the space either. Hey y'all, my name is Mariah. Y'all can add me on Instagram, T-H-3-Y, love dot Raya. Everything else will be on there, so y'all could just go on there. Oh, y'all. Yeah. Oh, oh, pop quiz. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I was like, SOS, I gotta work on my Spanish. Um, I'm Ariana, my Instagram's Ari Gillum, my TikTok's Ariana Gillum, and then my YouTube is Ariana Yoga. You do yoga? Yeah, yoga. Can you yeah do oh yeah, yeah. Hey, do I'm a yoga teacher. Do, do one pose for us real quick. We could do it all here together, but it's not going to be what you think. You're just going to okay, okay. literally sit back, squeeze your shoulder blades, like behind, squeeze them right there. Okay. Squeeze them right now. Oh. Squeeze, and then release. Okay. And then, uh, let's do that yeah. about five times. It's like a posture check. You will feel better. And it's you low effort. Like, it feel like you just blew my back out virtually just doing that. Wait. Hold on, bro. Hold on. <laughs> no. I gotta, I gotta, no, <laughs> I gotta revisit the benefits pause. over here. <laughs> That's a super pause. That ain't no pause. That's a super pause. <laughs> yeah, yeah. The fat red card. In today's video, we'll cover all of Ichigo's forms in Bleach. We'll start with his regular form, but in later parts of the video, we'll explain some of his most powerful, legendary forms. In his human okay. form, Ichigo is incredibly strong for a high schooler. Ever since Ichigo was a child, he used to go to a dojo to train with Totsuki. Although Ichigo wasn't as strong back then and used to lose a lot, he changed after his mother's death and became very strong. Since then, he has repeatedly shown great agility and coordination in his attacks. What's really oh, impressive is that Ichigo is also very very courageous and doesn't care for the number of enemies he has to fight to protect his friends. Ichigo stopped training for a short time, but the constant attacks from bullies and his father kept his skills fresh. Although this is Ichigo's weakest form, his natural talent and hard work will lead him to becoming much stronger in the future. Shinigami form. Ichigo obtains his Shinigami powers for the first time when his family is in great danger of a hollow attack. At that time, an okay. injured Rukia could no longer fight, so she gave Ichigo her powers to defeat the hollow form. Surprisingly, a complete novice like Ichigo Ichigo managed to defeat a massive hollow effortlessly, which mm. even a skilled Shinigami like Rukia had trouble fighting. When awakening his Shinigami powers, Ichigo also obtains his Zanpakuto, a soul cutter sword. The base form of Zanpakuto is the same for all Shinigamis, but what makes them different- Soul cutter sword, dang, we just thought we had one sword. No, nah, you got the soul cutter. You That's could crazy. cut souls? That's crazy. Yep. That's crazy. That's crazy. Are the powers right obtained in the Shikai and the Bankai forms? The borrowed Three. power allowed Ichigo to fight alongside Rukia and his friends, who also unlocked their abilities due to the Hogyoku inside Rukia. However, even with his natural talent and newfound powers, Ooh. Ichigo wasn't untouchable in this form. Ooh. Therefore, he suffered his first serious defeat against Renji and Byakuya, who came to the human world to take Rukia back and punish her for staying in the human world for too long. I also heard hey. these guys punish people who don't hit the subscribe sure button, so make sure to click it oh. just to be safe. <laughs> anyway. After the fight, Byakuya took the borrowed powers, leaving Ichigo completely powerless. However, with Kisuke's help, Ichigo obtains his own Shinigami powers and finds out the name of his Zanpakuto. Ichigo uses this form most of the time, especially in the Soul That's Society. His newly obtained powers oh, paid off, as his rematch against Renji went exceptionally yeah, well. The last time the two met, Bigger Renji had easily beaten him, even with his powers restricted. <laughs> this time, however, the tables had turned and Ichigo <laughs> defeated Renji, who fought against him with everything he had. What truly showed showcased his strength was the battle against the captain of the 11th division, Kenpachi Soraki, who's well known for being a beast in Whoa. combat. Ichigo has crazy. one of the most thrilling fights scary. in the series with Zaraki and pushes him to remove scar. his eye patch, which was limiting his powers. The guy defeated a captain what? despite being an amateur what? Shinigami who didn't even know how to control his own spiritual power. Around this blind. time, Ichigo's strength had increased even more from battling strong foes in the Soul Society. Moreover, his speed significantly increased as well, which even impressed Whoa, Yoki, 
Korean is well people. known for his flash step. However, Byakuya is a formidable foe and can't be taken down that easily. Uh, Therefore, oh, Yoichi tried to was a much stronger state <laughs> of his Zonpakuto so that he could have a chance against the captain of the 6th division, Bankai form. With all the captains of the Soul Society on his back, Ichigo had to gain more power to save Rukia, but he had no time to waste. So Ichigo obtains a new form, Bankai, through special training Bankai. with Yoichi. It's important to note that only captains and powerful lieutenants have Bankai, which cannot be obtained easily. What's more, it takes over 10 years of practice to completely Dang. master this form and use it properly. As our main character didn't really have 10 years, he fights on the physically for two and a half days and manages to achieve his Bankai. This power did wonders for wow. him. Zombacto's size decreased, increasing his speed and destructive power. It proved to be a game changer in the fight with Byakuya, as he managed to actually see Byakuya's flash step and effortlessly dodge his attack as well. What's more, like Ichigo started using a strong attack called Getsuka Tensho, which gave him an edge in the battle. However, it would be highly unrealistic for Ichigo to defeat a captain of Byakuya's level when he was just a novice, and he realizes this pretty soon. This eventually leads him to awaken an even more powerful form, Hollow Form. Unable to move oh. his body and being repeatedly oh, cut and stabbed by Byakuya, Ichigo is on his knees and almost about to die. However, just as Byakuya is about to land the final blow, Ichigo's holification begins. During this but period, Ichigo that? has no control over his hollow self, and the power he showcases is immense and chaotic, making him faster, oh. stronger, go and crazy. more reckless than before. His powers completely change the course of the fight, it's pushing scary. Byakuya to go on the defensive <laughs> after the hollow form severely down. I'm sorry. I, I mean, that was a pause moment for a second. On his what? knees and about to land a blow, but I wasn't going to say anything, though. <laughs> I completely missed that. I did not hear that. <laughs> oh, yeah. Ichigo you know manages it. to retake his consciousness by breaking the mask and proceeds to fight with his Bankai, eventually winning the fight. Uh, Later the in the mask? series, Ichigo forms a companionship with ex Soul Society captains and lieutenants who are hollowfied by Aizen and are known as Visards. The Visards so then he help him tame his inner hollow through it. tough training by making yeah. him enter his inner world. In there, he had to fight Hollow Ichigo to access the powers as okay. he pleases and remain conscious while using them. While Ichigo oh, was fighting like, his hollow, yeah, yeah, Visor yeah. fought unconscious it's Ichigo like in the real world while he was fully <laughs> hollified. Oh, After retaking his consciousness, Ichigo stopped his hollowified self and broke the mask. Ichigo okay. could use the mask for only four seconds he at a time, Halloween and after is. training with the visors, four his length increased to 11 <laughs> seconds. However, his growth didn't stop there as the time That's limit of crazy. his mask further increases during his third rematch with the sixth Espada, Grimjaw Jagger Jax. Here we see Ichigo using the mask for an extended period of time in order to fight on equal grounds with Grimjaw's second form. I know it looks like Bond. Form. During Ichigo's um, fight with the fourth Espada, Ukiura Cypher, sense. he realizes the massive difference in their powers and couldn't do much against him. On the brink of death, Ichigo is lying on the floor after Ukiura shoots a Cerro Oscurus through his chest mm. that even Orihime Ooh. couldn't heal. Everyone thought that Ichigo almost, died at that time. However, as Orihime begins to cry, Ichigo pushes himself oh, and his inner hollow takes over again, but this time with a massive change in his appearance. Ichigo becomes oh, a vast olu, having leveling, long yeah. straight hair all the way down to his waist. What confirms that he's a hollow now is the hole in his chest, which he oh. didn't have any of the previous times he hollified. The scariest part of this transformation is his hollow mask that covers the entirety of his face looking like a skull with big menacing horns. This form of Ichigo okay. is entirely mindless That's and chaotic, crazy. with the only goal of crushing everything in front of him, both friends and friends. Vasto Lorde Ichigo has new, very powerful abilities, one of them being a Seto, which can cause widespread destruction. He also gained immense strength, allowing him to destroy a significant portion of Las Noches with just one swing of his blade. The guy oh. easily tore off Ukiora's arm in the blink of an eye. Dang. This alone should be enough for everyone to realize wow. just how powerful he really is now. Furthermore, no, Ichigo you. also demonstrates several more <laughs> abilities like Fast Regeneration and Sonido, a high-speed movement technique utilized by Hollows and Arankar. Moreover, he almost killed Uryu, but Okiora broke his horn, which reverted Ichigo back into his okay. normal state. Okay. Although he never say, how does he get again, out? some of the forms we'll soon cover are even more powerful than this one, Dungai form. Next is Ichigo's Dungai well, he form, like a stripper, which he obtains no. after witnessing just oh, how no. he was edgy, At that time, but okay. gave up to despair, <laughs> losing hope to fight due to the massive difference in power. However, Ichimaru and Ichigo's father saw his potential. Therefore, Ishin takes him to Dungai, a corridor-like dimension connecting the Soul Society and the human world. Time flows faster in Dongai compared to the outside world, okay. so Ishin teaches Ichigo the final Getsuga Tensho in under three months, which will help him greatly in defeating Aizen. Afterwards, Ichigo okay. rejoins 
the battle with a completely new appearance, now much taller and with his hair grown. In this state, it appears that Ichigo has his bond kind of The difference now is that Getsuga is also merged with him. Ichigo's spiritual power was so strong that even Aizen couldn't sense it. The Donkai form considerably increased Ichigo's speed and power, allowing him to battle Aizen without even getting a scratch. What's more, Ichigo even returned the favor by easily catching Aizen's sword, much like he did Ichigo's back in the Soul Society arc. The guy really made Aizen delusional, making him think that all the destruction around them was his powers, but in reality, it was all Ichigo's doing. Although Aizen yeah. continued to grow due to the Hokyoku in his body, Ichigo still managed to slice him in his fourth fusion and easily blocked his attacks. Final Getsuga Tensho. Oh, to put an end to Aizen point. once and for all, Ichigo uses the final Getsuga Tensho form. In this state, Ichigo Ichigo becomes Getsuga himself, meaning he uses oh, the entirety of his now. soul as a source of spiritual power for one significant it. attack. Ichigo explains that if he uses this technique, he loses all his abilities as a Shinigami, making it the final Getsuga Tensho. Ichigo learned this ability in his inner world while fighting Zangetsu for three mm. months. Zangetsu was entirely against teaching Ichigo this last technique because he wanted to protect him from the dire consequences of the method. Eventually, Ichigo convinces him, leading Zangetsu to stab Ichigo with the blade, telling him that by accepting his sword, he will acquire the final Getsuga Tensho. In the end, Ichigo had to resort to using this technique because Aizen became immortal and would regenerate incredibly fast, oh, which meant that he no. had to go all out and quickly end him. Ichigo's appearance changes as his hair grows longer and turns black, giving him a very no, mysterious really and emo. terrifying look. Yeah, right. Ichigo swings towards Aizen, <laughs> Me doing so winter. causes a massive veil of black spiritual power to erupt upwards and approach the target, heavily damaging anything caught within That's the blast. That's a cool form though, the I like it. technique is strong enough to severely damage Aizen, forcing him to use his weaker transformation. After this attack, the black spiritual power disappears as Ichigo falls to the ground in severe pain, losing his Shinigami powers. But in the end, no. this form had weakened Aizen oh. enough to allow Urahara to seal him away. Oh, there straight are only three forms left to cover, and trust go all me, out. you definitely won't want to miss these. Full bring form. After losing his powers as a okay. result of his previous like transformation, super. Ichigo finds out that becoming a Fullbringer would help him become a Shinigami again. Fullbringers are spiritually aware humans okay. born with the eponymous ability, Fullbring, which allows them How to convenient. manipulate the souls that reside in all physical matter. What? This power is awakened in children bet. whose mothers were attacked by hollows, yeah, and up. since Ichigo's mother falls into that group, Ichigo gains access to Fullbring powers. In this form, Ichigo becomes much faster, and also gains the ability no, to jump high into the air, which yeah. really helps him in his fights. In That's addition, Ichigo can generate yeah. swirling blasts of spiritual power, comparable to Getsuga Tensho in appearance, maybe even in strength. Ichigo eventually regained his Shinigami powers after being stabbed in the back by Rukia with a special sword oh, containing hey. spiritual energies given There's by a lot of stabbing. and lieutenants. Before we cover Ichigo's most powerful form in the entire show, let's first quickly cover his Shinigami rebuild form. During the Thousand Years Blood War arc, Ichigo fails to defeat Yi Watch and undergoes training in the Royal Palace in preparation for the war. There, Ichigo Ichigo discovered that he also had Quincy's powers. Ichigo's father, is Ishin, that? is the reason for his inheritance of Shinigami energy, while okay. his mother, Masaki, is the responsible for family. both his inherited Quincy and Hollow powers. Yeah. After mastering Zangetsu, Ichigo is transformed into a new and powerful Shinigami form with two Zonpaktos, yeah. one representing the Hollow form forms. looking like his old blade, <laughs> and the other his spiritual Shinigami, which is smaller. Lots After reclaiming his powers, too, he also like, got huh, versions notes. of his attacks. Uh -huh. Now he can release an exceptionally powerful Getsuga Tensho with his knife-like sword and giant shock with the other one. More Additionally, form. he gains a new attack Dying. and combines the two blades, releasing an attack named Getsuga Jujisho. Bankai hey, that's better. Ichigo achieves this state <laughs> yeah, by placing his swords together in a specific way. In this form, the outer section of the blade turns white with the addition of a chain connecting the hilt and the edge of the blade. In short, Ichigo combines all his power and obtains the ultimate form beyond holification, which even you oh, oh. missed. Unlike his vast <laughs> Lorde form, he was completely conscious, assuring scared Orihime that it really was him and not a mindless creature thirsting for blood. Ichigo then explains how his mother's and father's powers were constantly at odds with each other, but now they finally have found balance. His appearance changed again, making him look like a mixture of Relatable. his Masto Lorde and Shinigami forms with the giant white <laughs> horn on his head. The Bankai rebuild gave him great speed and strength, allowing Ichigo to pose a threat to Yuhavak, even making him draw his blades out. Although Ichigo managed to perform a very powerful attack by combining his Getsuga Tensho with Granre Sero, in the end it was easily blocked by Yuhavak. He then proceeded to no. break Ichigo's Bankai and overpower no. him rather easily. However, again. after you have leave to destroy again. the Soul Society, Ichigo Zangetsu was fully restored with the help of Tsukishima okay. with his Book of the End and Orihime's Soten Kishun. In the end, with the help of Aizen and Uryu, Ichigo swings his blade one last time and finally defeats the father of Quincy.
Ooh. Dang, okay. Yeah. Defeat the father. He defeated him. He defeated him. Finally defeated him. Dang. Let's go. Forms. It was like a hundred forms he got, ain't it? Oh, dying, you know leveling up, more swords, dying you know again. You know crazy about this show, though? I know it's a fan out here who probably got all the collection of the swords in their house. I know it got to be That's dope. Probably, yeah. Yeah, that's going to be dope. Be cool. Yeah. I want, Honestly, like, some hanging. I like this funny. show. I didn't I didn't spend a lot of time like honestly I would just put it on in the background because to me they're just doing the same thing every episode but like I see now that there's more. Yeah, that's <laughs> crazy. Cassie, what you got to say about it? <laughs> say? It was crazy. Dude, it was a lot of big swords. That's not that I know. I oh, never no. seen this. I know about it, but I never seen this. It was a lot of big swords, pause. Yeah, big I think oh, you're the pause. Oh. I think you're the pause. Because why are these always on your mind? <laughs> why are on your mind, why, my guy? why is it always yeah, easy for you to that. point it out? Why did you say that, Brandon? Why did you say that? Why did you say that? No. Why are you thinking that? Yeah, why? Because Raya said that she's happy that the sword was taller. You said something about it blasting. You know hey, don't bring up my words. Don't twist my words here. Nah. <laughs> we no, no, you missed it. You said the sword was, I'm just saying, because the sword was big. It was bigger than their bodies, like Raya said. You bigger know? than him. Like, he looked like he was right. like, carrying it. But the emo form, I like how his parents just had to stop arguing. They're like, oh, they stopped arguing. We good now. I can control myself. Yeah. That's nice. all. But hey, y'all hit the like, hit the sub, follow these beautiful ladies, follow Rainy TV. Hey, we out. Gang.